Hey, fabulous first graders, I'm back. Welcome to my kitchen. You were already in it, but we were sitting on the floor with Penelope. I asked you to do a little bit of drawing on your board for math. You were supposed to take that four and three and add them together because four, so if you didn't do this now, grab your dry erase board and do it right now with me. Four plus three equals seven. How would I figure that out? I decided how I wanted to try it was by drawing four and drawing three and then I counted them all to get to seven. Your second set of your job, or second step of your job, sorry, was to tell me whether four plus three equaled eight. Four plus three equals seven and not eight. Did you try writing all of those number sentences down? What I mean is, did you write the first one and then by yourself, did you tell me, oh, sorry, board, if it equaled eight or not? So you could say no, you could say it's not equal, you could also do the same thing I did where I said four plus three equals seven and not eight. I can't wait to see them. Go ahead and snap a picture and send it to me if you'd like. Otherwise, practice writing it by yourself. Then we're gonna get ready for our next job. So you're going to, in the next video, make sure you have a um, green math book and your big brain and some Play-Doh. We're gonna use Play-Doh, but not very long, only for two math problems. So again, if you don't use Play-Doh in your life, like you're like, oh, I have kinetic sand, get it. If you don't have Play-Doh, grab a piece of paper and you can write the dots that we make together on there. Whatever you have that you could make little dots with and it's okay with your parents, grab it. I'll see you shortly for some more math. Bye.